Hello, here I am recording this bit from the rector's study on what until a few minutes ago was a sunny Lenten afternoon. It seems that the clouds have rolled back in, but on my way over to the church a little while ago, I noticed that the snow was actually beginning to melt off the sidewalks and from the icicles that have formed on our buildings. <laughs> Perhaps we have come out of that deep freeze that we've been in recently. At any rate, it turned my thoughts to spring. Too early, no doubt. But maybe a dose of springtime is just what we all need right now. So I had decided that I would try, rather than my usual written rector's ramblings in our e-blast each week, to do a little video segment, mostly on something Lent related. So in just a moment or two, I am going to switch to a little video I did last year. And I hope that it will bring springtime to mind to you as well. I do that because some of the earliest derivations of the word for Lent have to do with the coming of spring, that waiting time, that time when we reflect on our lives, perhaps we undertake some Lenten disciplines that are not our usual daily fare. Or perhaps we just try to be more aware of ourselves and our relationship to God in this time. We do that, and even if there is some deprivation that comes, we know that Lent will come to an end, that spring will come, and with it, the good news of the resurrection. So I hope you enjoy this little springtime video. May you have a holy Lent. Mm -hmm. 